I think the reason all of us got so excited about the script was as opposed to, say, Wolf of Wall Street or as opposed to some other uh, Too Big to Fail, I think it is sort of, this movie is sort of like a, uh, it's a hero story. I mean, we're following these guys, we're rooting for them to be right, uh, that the bubble's going to burst, that these awful evil banks and predatory lenders are going to go under, and if they do, then we win. But if we win, it means everybody loses in the country. It means that Main Street uh, is wiped out and foreclosed on. And uh, the movie carries both of those things at the same time. It's not a typical Adam McKay film, but he shoots it like an Adam McKay movie. So, uh, which means that, you know, the subject matter which we're discussing, while dense, is going to be super funny and super entertaining. So he's back there shouting out a funny way to say credit default swap. And, uh, and digestible way, just he, he makes your CDO and CDS sound like cereal, that would be yummy. He uses this technique where we'll be in a scene like this, and then I'll go like this to you and say, I'm Hamish Linklater, and I have no idea really what I'm talking about in this movie. And then I'll go back into the scene and pretend like I do know what I'm talking about in this movie. It's a real privilege to be in a socially conscious movie. Uh, but, geez, hey, cut away to the camera. America, you got screwed. This is the movie that explains why. Don't let it happen again.